I right. think it's and going. from Stark Strength and Conditioning. You can tell because I'm wearing the shirt. And this is Kat from Kids Initiative. Hey, <laughs> we're here to talk to you about the Burpee Challenge that, that is being held um, benefiting Kids Initiative. So it's being held on September 28th. And the goal of it is to complete a thousand burpees, whether you're on a team or individual. So I'll let Paul explain that to you. Okay, so if you're going to do the individual, uh, just like Kat said, you're doing a thousand burpees for time. Um, if you decide to go on a team of four, you do 250 burpees each relay style before your next teammate goes on. If you do a team of 10, which is the least amount of burpees you can do, maximum number of people on a team is 10, uh, then you just have to do 100 each. So when you do that, uh, the next person goes on the team. So you, you don't split it up like 10 and 10, and we want you doing 100, and then uh, on to the next person. So um, how much is it to register, Kat? To register individual, it's $20, and then as a team, it's $100. So you can have up to 10 people paying $10 each. Okay. So our standards for the burpee, we do have standards. Um, <laughs> yeah, is, we do. Yeah, we do. <laughs> <laughs> is, uh, we want to make contact with the ground. So chest to ground. You're freaking me out. Hey, <laughs> keep looking over there. So chest to ground for those burpees. So they can be a strict burpee, which is going to take more energy. Um, so not something you're, I'm going to recommend for if you're going to be doing a high number of burpees. So strict burpee would be dropping down to the ground comes in contact with the ground and then uh, you're getting some uh, some uh, air between your feet and the ground every time so we need to jump in after every burpee uh, right after that um, don't distract me so uh, the other option is just kind of more of a, a, a slobby type burpee where you're gonna drop to the ground it's gonna be more efficient uh, still same thing you get some... can you do it again I may have missed that I can't sure <laughs> don't blink So just dropping to the ground is gonna be a little quicker, a little less taxing on your muscles um, and help you to stay fresh a little bit longer. So that's, uh, that's kind of what we're looking for. We'll have a judge counting your reps. So if you're not bringing your chest to the ground, we want you coming all the way to the ground. So thighs, abdomen, chest, touching the ground. If, uh, if you're not doing that, the judges will not count your reps. You have to get a bit of a jump in. I don't care if it's a centimeter, I don't care if it's an inch, two inches. We wanna make sure that your feet are leaving the ground. Yep, and you can find all the information at either kidsinitiative.ca or starkstrength.com and you can also request pledge sheets if you want individuals to pledge you for all the burpees that you're doing and all funds go directly to Kids Initiative. Thanks. Thanks, Kat.